Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be checking out a faction server. Yeah, you heard me right. A faction server. I think it's been years since I reviewed one, but let's check it out. Now, you guys normally know that I don't review faction servers for multiple reasons. First things first, a lot of them are like the same, and I'm not, I haven't been a fan of the faction community. It's either A, toxic, B, filled with a lot of hackers or x rayers. Yes, people use x ray like crazy and just like able to detect people's bases and detect resources. And it's probably the hardest community to maintain. Other than the PvP community, I think the faction community is the hardest. So, to anyone that makes a faction server, I give you guys huge props. Like, it is very, very, very difficult to keep up with all these hackers and how toxic they are. You know what I mean? But one thing I love about this server, and it is my absolute favorite feature, is that it works for both Bedrock and Java Edition, guys. So say that you only have, you know, console or mobile, and you want to play with your friends that's on PC that has Java Edition, you can do that with this server, which is awesome. So that that that's awesome. Really hope that the server has a good anti cheat. It needs it. It absolutely needs it. But let's check out the spawn. The spawn is not too bad. It gets the job done. It's nothing massive. I really hate massive spawns. This is not massive. Got yourself a little ender chest, and then you got yourself dragon rewards. Oh, wait. Oh shoot okay so first things first when you're doing a server make sure you do claim your dragon rewards you get a daily back tomorrow to continue your streak nice and i even got myself in <laughs> okay a little achievement this is the same thing all right got a little pvp lobby you got stronghold we're gonna be checking these out in a bit you got your balance your top balances you got your list of factions we're about to check out in a bit you also got the shop a lot of you guys may say this is basic but honestly i prefer this than like this being all the way across the map you know what i mean it is super frustrating you got also auctions and you can also sell stuff as well that is not bad i like that but before we check out anything i kind of want to see the list of factions let's see what factions is in the server so far and one thing i do have to say before i start this you know owner if you could move this sign you know because it is kind of blocking these npcs that would be very much appreciated but basic commands these are definitely this needs to be in a spawn list of factions let's see what we got two pages okay so you can see the land you can see the power and and the max powers i'm pretty sure the more you build or the more that you gather resources and you put in your land um or the more money you get for your you know faction the more that you're able to expand and the more power you're able to get um so this is definitely a new system that i have never seen before so you can see that uh limitless you know it has 85 land 100 power and 100 max power so i think 100 is the absolute max you can get and i think you start off with 000 or 0 10 10 if i'm not mistaken so and then you can also see how many players is in the faction or actually how many are online right now so these are how many people are in the faction which is 10 there is zero online which is awesome okay that's not bad and i know a lot of you guys would use this towards your advantage if say that you want to raid a faction you know that they're online you could come to this person see who's online and then you know get straight to it <laughs> top balances i don't think i even want to see this because it's gonna make me jelly but we're gonna hit it and ordering balances for 548 players top balance is zero and okay so i definitely know that this is false i know there's people that probably like has thousands already <laughs> my balance obviously i have zero so yeah this this probably needs to be updated we got the pvp lobby we definitely gotta check that out Ooh, ooh okay i like how clean this is like nothing too crazy it gets straight to the point you don't understand how much i love that and you also got some ender chests if you want to put your stuff away that you don't want to lose so you can go back to the spawn you got arena one you got development so i don't know if you can even join that and then you got arena two so i kind of want to join arena one see how it looks maybe join the others as well arena one and okay gets the job done like i said i am a very big fan of just keeping things simple not over complicated things and this server definitely gets the job done i actually want to see what development is maybe it's not you know fully done but we can definitely check it out and yeah it's development okay i was just <laughs> i was just making sure there's arena two oh i i'm honestly i'm gonna be real with you guys i kind of like these i wish it was a little bit bigger but i really like how these are like it gets the job done and honestly i would use this arena to pvp people you know what i mean and while i'm going to the server we're checking out other things as well if you guys want me to start a pvp series which i don't know if you guys are going to want me to because like the things i have listed in the beginning of the video how toxic can be not only that just i mean i could deal with the toxicity it's just the hack Hackers. I know it's an all time high PVP and the faction community are the two communities that have the absolute most amount of hackers, but I could try to deal with it. If you guys want a faction series, let's get this video to mm, 500 likes, 500 likes. And I definitely can create a faction right now. If create wither. Oh my God. I feel like this is going to be taken and it is what? 
Oh, wow. I like that as well. You don't understand how many faction servers that you could just immediately make a faction without having to build up income. You know what I mean? So this encourages you go get that money, you know, go get some blocks, whatever it is, you know, go mining, come over here, come sell some stuff. And then yes, it costs 4k to make a faction. Um, so that makes sense. I like that. I like that. I'm definitely gonna have to get to some grinding right after this video and make a faction named Wither or Wither Nation. You know what I mean? We got the stronghold now. I what? Hold on. What is Am I missing something here? Stuff over here. Can we even mine this? No, we can't. But there is some stuff. Is this what in the world? I just realized what the these are people's heads. No way. So you're telling me if players die, their head will just be on the that is toxic. I don't like the feeling of that. And it might be my internet, by the way. My internet has been acting up. But yeah, you got um you got player heads and there might be something that's going to jump scare me in a second. So, uh, make sure you guys do beware. It's like one, two, three, four player heads. Oh my God. Oh, it's nothing too. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I think there's a zombie right behind me, by the way. I, I got this thing. Where does this thing even go? It just, okay. So, Hey, easy way to make money. There's some zombie spawners. There's about at least two to three in here. This thing just keeps going and going and go. I am scared. I don't know if you guys know, but like I am low key, like kind of afraid of the dark. So like, uh, yeah. Oh my God. You can see the health of these things is what, what in the no knockback is that? I like how you can see the health of them though. Oh my God. Okay. All right. All right. Chill out, chill out, chill out. Yeah. Okay. All right. You know what? We're going to make these things kill me actually. Uh, mm, nah, I'm good. I'm good. I want to see my head, but honestly, I'm good. I'm just going to slap. Oh shoot. Nope. 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 I'm good because these are literally the only things I have and 10 iron. I'm going to need that to make some better gear. I'm good. Yes, I just chickened out. <laughs> we also have auctions. So let's see what we got over here. So we got Lord Cheese. No way. Dang, I could really tell how toxic that's going to get. Imagine you just destroy someone and next thing you know, you have their head and you just sell their head on the auction house like oh my god that would be so toxic imagine one of you guys just roll me and then you guys have my head and you just sell it on the, i would be i would be annoyed i would be frustrated and i would do everything in my power to buy the head because like wow lord she's head you got another player head by lord she lord she is just on something so if i ever see them on the server um yeah wolf spawner a million i mean it makes sense i don't <sighs> 500k for a camel spawner. You also got these. Uh, wait, you could have horses in the server? Okay, not bad. The server also have bosses as well. So I'm pretty sure if you venture out to the, you know, the wild, you probably find yourself some bosses. I think we're about to do that in a bit, actually. Share chords with privately with a player. Oh, what? Oh, wow. I want to kind of venture out to the wild. Oh, have a nice little animation. Oh, I like that. I like that. Oh my bye. Whoa. What did we just spawn into? Hold on. Wait, does the server have a custom biome? Hold up. Wait, a yes, it has a custom biome. What in the actual world? This is beautiful, guys. I highly suggest if you have a faction server as well as having a custom biome. I mean, it makes the biggest difference. Ever. Look, look at this. Look at this. So you got this level 12 sheep. Okay, level nine sheep. So this is giving some Pokemon vibes right off the bat. And you got this donkey that's level 18. So this is very difficult. So green is easy. Yellow is just in between. And then obviously red is hard. So, um, I mean, we could try going for the level 12 sheep. Come on, come over here. There we go. And I'm pretty sure the more that you, um, you know, kill sheep, the more XP you get as well, the more levels you get. Learning a new skill as well. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. You got a little bar on the top when you're learning a new skill. I like that. There we go. There we go. So I'm pretty sure we actually do more damage and we're able to get more things the more levels we go up. So that's actually pretty dope. And honestly, I'm really liking the server. The reason why the server doesn't have like a bunch of things, I know the server could have way more, but it is very, very difficult to have a bunch of things and make it work for both Bedrock Edition and Java Edition. That's why the server doesn't have like a bunch of things like custom enchants and all that, because I'm pretty sure it is very difficult to have that working on both Bedrock and Java Edition. So the server has to keep it simple and have things that are able to use by both players that's not gonna be able to you know be exploited all that which makes sense that's the you know drawback from you know having cross compatibility that makes sense but i like that should i oh no no you guys are gonna cancel me if i even try touching it yeah mm -mm. i'm not gonna hit the donkey at all 
I'll just go for the sheep. Why does it look like the sheep wants to attack me though? I don't know why. But yeah, this definitely has a custom biome because I don't remember these, you know, boost rooms being in Minecraft with lights. And I don't remember a biome looking like this. But if you guys want to join the server, make sure you guys do join the server. IP import will be in the description below. Like I said, I don't normally review faction servers, but I feel like it's, I, it's not really fair. I should give the faction community a chance. The faction community is probably, you know, one of the first communities to ever be on Minecraft in general. So, you know, I'm going to give it a shot. You know, like I said, 500 likes and i'll definitely do a series i don't mind invite some of you guys build a huge empire and just go crazy but thank you guys for watching the video it is your boy patsar i'll see y'all in the next one peace out